We have been buying players tirelessly for the last 24 hours and we finally finished the Centurion's Crafting Upgrade. So you're going to see whether it was truly worth it or not. And if you haven't started already, maybe you do, maybe you don't. Now all you've got to do to say thank you is drop a like down below and subscribe if you're new because I got banned from doing SPCs about 7 times. And if you do want to do this yourself, I did do a video on how to complete it free, so make sure to go check that out. Do you want the best team in FC25? Yeah, baby! Do you want to be able to buy players like this or this and not be stuck with a team like this? Oh! Then you need to head over to skycoach.com. GG. Select the amount of coins or which weekend league boost you'd like. Make sure to pop in Pro Recall at checkout and enjoy your new team. So we click L in. We claim the whole group. Of course, we've got 100 of the packs to do. We've then got, I'd say, not a bad uh, array of rewards there as well. We probably should have done that at the end because now they're going to be sat at the front. It's going to make it a little bit difficult to go through these packs, I think. Yeah, they always do that. So we're just going to we're just going to run through all of these uh, and see what we can get. So we've got 78 times twos first. So this is part of the reward for doing it, I think. Now, basically, we've got like 110 packs, I think it is. There are 105 crafting upgrades you could do. Now, I've cleared my entire club to do these. I will do the other five at the end if it's worth it. Now, first one, we've got a 75 times three, and we've got an 85. So pack number two, first one was an 85. Oh, second one's a walkout. Guys, these might be cracked. We've got Peugeot in pack number two. Okay, guys, we are two in. We have an 85 and 87. These are pretty good. Okay, pack three is a fumble, but but pack one and two, uh, good start. German center back, Bundesliga, of course. Yeah, that, I mean, that checks out. What do you mean by that? We've got a rest. You know what? We'll take that. So far, with four packs in, walkout 85 inform. That's... Uh, these might just truly be a lot more worth it than the community thought. Another walkout? Surely not. Goalkeeper. Uh, I, I, Endler? 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 The thing that would get me, like, I would be most gassed about is a Centurion's card. Decent value. I mean, Palmer's definitely not bad. This, guys, highlight real wise so far. I have got so many more in the first, like, few packs than I ever expected to get. 84s? I mean, look, guys, I... <laughs> I don't want to gas these up too much because obviously a lot of people were saying how bad these rewards are, but I think the pack weight on these is crazy good. Okay, look, it's fine. We can have a couple stinkers in a row. We, we, we've had almost two good rewards so far. Almost two good rewards so far. Okay, 84 in the next one. That's not too bad at all. Pack, whatever it is, we're skipping it. I don't know if that was a walkout or not. And it was an 84. It's not bad. I think as it stands from the packs we've opened, we've got more value back from the packs than what we've put in. So each one's in theory like 6K. Initially, they were like four. And then the price, price rose. So ideally, we want to walk away with an average of six plus K per pack, which if we get one card for like 100, 200K, we're absolutely golden to be fair. Oh, you know what? Another another 85. Very decent. I was like, honestly, the thing that would make my day the most is Hansen. Now, I know it's basically one of the best cards that's available right now, but Hansen has just been my like my favorite card this year. I love her gold card. Her inform, weirdly, does not perform for me the way that her gold card does, but her cracked card, Ballon d'Or card, Another 85. Back to Hansen. Her cracked card was absolutely cracked. So I'm hoping to just pick her up. Or Son. Son would be pretty cool. Now, admittedly, some of these packs are absolute stinkers. They're just like three players, like 80 rated. Uh, this one here, probably, I mean, we've got an 84 and 83. But like the worst case scenario here is a couple 80 rated. It's really not that bad. If you look at the cost of the cards, they're like the minimum return you're getting per pack is like 2K. So you're at a 4K loss in the worst packs. But in the best packs, obviously so far we've had informs, we've had 87s, we've had 85s, quite a lot, quite a lot of 85s actually. Two walkouts, we've had an 88 as well. It's, it's pretty good. Right, OBS crashed, but we've got Sheridan Delict. Not too bad of a pack, to be fair, 85 and 84 in terms of value, more than what we've paid into each pack. So I feel like we're doing quite well so far. Like, I know everyone went, like, kind of mad over these rewards. And I'll be honest, I was kind of raging when I saw the original rewards, but these are pretty good. Like, we're actually getting a lot back here. I think they put a lot of our good pack luck in the first few sets. We've had a few dud packs, I'm not going to lie, but I don't know how far we are in. I feel like we've maybe opened 20 possibly 30 packs I, i'm trying to like gauge it in my head might be a little bit more still getting 84s and 83s we haven't seen a walkout since endler um we've seen a couple 85 since then have we got a walkout here no okay i was about to complain but 83 and 84 is not too bad they really waited for me to give them all the compliments and then they've just dumped all the kind of meaty packs on me we haven't had a walkout in a while i know that's an odd complaint because we went in kind of expecting not to get many but we've only had two walkouts we've had one inform a lot of 85s admittedly and we can kind of review what we've got at the end by going through our newest but i'm a little bit 
unsure. I feel like they need to give me a walkout soon to keep my enthusiasm. Which, based off how EA have done content this year, means they're not going to give me another walkout at all. Right, we're going to do close-eyed skip pack. What we get? Walkout? No. Okay, do you know what? 84 is all right. So we still have over 40, 50 packs to go. We're not even on to the, the kind of special packs yet. I'm feeling like we're going to end up packing, looking at these, like Feren Torres, maybe Tar, maybe Muller, um, or Sinclair. Someone that's not like good, but is like, oh, it's worth 100k. If we could get Renard, I'd actually finally have um, her back in the squad. We haven't had her in the squad since last year. She had obviously a few cracked cards. If we went um, Bruno or Raphael, I'd be pretty gassed with. And I'd be gassed with Modric or, I guess, Rodri. I mean, Hansen, of course, is the queen. Okay, 85. The 85s are back. Okay, we're, we're building up. Next is going to be an 86. Mark my words. We're getting an 86. 2,000 years later. Three, two, one. Walk out. I got it. I actually got it. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, that's Kimmich. Yeah, that is Kimmich, I think. Oh my God, I've got that right, haven't I? Do you know what? We take it. 86. It was an 86. It was a walkout. We got 80s with it. But do you know what? We've had now three walkouts, ton of 85s. I'm, you know, the, the vibe's back. We know walkouts still exist. We literally cleared my entire duplicate storage for this. And now we have 81 already. Okay, we're back to packs that don't even get a walkout animation. But, oh, they're all non-dupes. Brilliant. Thanks, EA. Okay, so we are getting down. I think we're at the last 30 packs. So hopefully we see a couple more walkouts. We see maybe another special card. That would be a success in my book. We've got a special card. We do have a special card. It's a right mid from France League One. Who on earth is that? Perrin. Do you know what? Perrin, Perrin doesn't look bad at all. That's a nice little card. We'll take that. We've now got two informs, three walkouts, ton of 85s, a lot of cards. I think we're, we're past the point, you know, where we're before we had, you know, a bit of value over what we've put in. We're not there anymore. Couple more walkouts, though. We could get back there. It really wouldn't be that hard. The whole set would be 600k in total. Um, what I've probably put in is about 450, 500k worth of stuff. We got the last walkout on cue. We said this is going to be a walkout. We're going to get the next one as well. So this is going to be not a walkout, but the next card is going to be a Centurions. I can guarantee it. The next card, three, two, one. We've gone and completed the final five that I hadn't done. You got 105, but the objective only goes up to 100. Don't know why they did that. Maybe it's because EA just simply cannot make objectives correctly. And clearly they can't make a game. Every time I send players to the club, it's going to bring up my friends list. We've got another inform. Not a walkout. This is the thing with the informs. I just want a good one. We got Kavista Garden. I, I don't hate it. I've had him a few times across his availability. So I'm kind of fed up of seeing him. I want to see someone else. Someone higher rated, ideally. Walkouts are scared, apparently. They're, they're scared of coming out. 85 again. That's been a while. We actually are happy to see an 85 again. Now, I've got... I want to say 20 packs left. We are getting to those better packs. Hopefully, one of them has something in store for us. Okay, we've got Chiesa. I mean, a little while ago, that would have been a banger. Not so much right now, but, you know, we'll take it. We are getting on to the final few packs. We need to see a walkout really very soon to make any of this worth it. Realistically, 500k down the drain. Have we hit a 500k value right now? Oh, how does my light go off as we get another walkout? That is annoying. I did say we needed another walkout. We've taken another 88. Have we got... I'd say value-wise, we're probably near maybe 100 and 110 120 i don't think we're anywhere higher than that so we kind of need a big a uh, big dog to come soon oh we got a walk out and i've just skipped it oh that's annoying i was looking at the light trying to fix okay pedri not really kind of walk out we want it's not really up to scratch right these are the last packs if we don't get a banger in here i'm afraid this has been i would say an l um i don't think okay walker 81 free no walk out if we don't get a 100 200k player here this is mud 82 5 walk out center mid german gunduan right it's not bad it's not the finish you'd ask for right, now for contrast we're gonna pop open one 
store pack to see what kind of results we get so we've done basically 600k worth of packs there and we've essentially had what i would say pretty poor results so from the store packs that are available we've got 95k i mean that one what's got the best chance of a good player so this pack here is 220k this one is 225 so this has a you know what? we'll go over this one this has basically a 40 percent chance of a centurion's player so you can choose to go down the route of doing all them packs spending all that time or you can buy one store pack and who we got cam spanish i don't actually know who that is we've got inform danny olmo which is better than any of the cards we got it doesn't look like we've got a walkout outside of that uh arguably a better pack oh, i guess that basically almost equals the, the results that we've got from there. Obviously, we didn't get as many walkouts. We've basically got 388 is the difference between 600k worth of crafting upgrades and one 200k store pack. I don't think that makes any sense. EA need to get a better crafting objective out next time because that was not worth the time. Let me know what you guys think and make sure to subscribe.